Hey guys, it's Kate. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. I'm really bad at intro. So today I'm gonna be doing a video inspired by Shelby Church and it's gonna be how much money I made off of a 1 million viewed YouTube video. So um, I'm sure a lot of you guys are curious. I've gotten a lot of questions. The first thing that comes out of people's mouths when I say that I make YouTube videos is how many subscribers you have and how much money do you make? So today I'm answering partially of one of those questions. I'm not gonna like just straight up show you like this is how much I've made because like I don't know it's like a super awkward like I hate it when people ask me how much money I make. So even if you've asked me before like it's okay don't feel bad it's just that it's a little bit awkward like I don't know because people kind of like judge you a certain way like they perceive that you make this much so they like they perceive you to be a certain way and that's honestly like not that true a lot of times okay so anyways today i'm gonna show you guys how much i make for a million views though so i just had dinner and i got interrupted literally like 30 seconds into this but uh, it looks so red now. Maybe if I fix it this way. Oh my goodness. Okay, never mind. We're just gonna keep it here, and you are going to have to deal with. You're gonna have to deal with that coloring. I apologize. It looks a little bit grainy now, but it's fine. You guys are not here for the visuals, hopefully. So the video that hit one million on my channel was I did a three-minute workout for 30 days with shocking results, and it just hit a million last. Tuesday I believe and so I waited for today for the um, money to all add up I guess because for some reason YouTube doesn't show like how much money you made like on that day that it happens it, it's a little bit laggy so I waited till today so that it shows a very accurate picture of exactly when I hit a million and how much money I made so I started my channel last July I got monetized in December, literally like a week before this video was posted. So the reason why I bring that up is because if you get if your account gets monetized after you post the video, then all the ad revenue that YouTube made before that, they're not going to give it to you and you basically make zero dollars. So let's say like the first video I ever posted was doing Alexis Ren's butt workout. It has like about 300k views ish or like 400 right now. and. I don't think I got monetized until it hit like 200k so all of that money from the 200,000 viewers that I made on that video isn't mine because I wasn't monetized so YouTube takes it from me so just in case you're wondering like if you're a creator like a smaller youtuber who hasn't gotten monetized yet but your video is blowing up you're not gonna get money until you hit a thousand subscribers and 240,000 minutes Follow my Instagram, by the way, if you don't, it's at kkagley, so you can participate in future videos. So, right now, the highest one someone said was $200,000. The common ones are like one to 10,000, and the lowest is $100. So I also did an Instagram poll to see how much money you guys think I make, because I thought it would be interesting, and that's also what Shelby Church did in her video, so I thought it might be cool for you guys to see, I guess. By the way, you can follow me on Instagram at KateKateLee right here in case you want to participate in future videos. So it looks like the lowest amount that someone said was a hundred bucks. <laughs> someone said zero dollars because it was copyrighted. That's funny. Good thing this one wasn't. Someone thinks I make two hundred thousand dollars. Okay, I definitely don't because if I did then I would not be going to school right now probably. <laughs> Okay, so I feel like the average is about like 5,000, you guys think? Or somewhere in like the 1 to 10,000s. Let's just get right into how much money I made for a million views. Okay, so right here. And now, drum roll please. This is what you've all been waiting for while you have had to listen to me drone on and on. This is how much money I made for a million views. $1,588.36. Yeah, there it is. Please don't click off yet, okay? Listen to what I have to say. Let's break this down because I feel like looking at the analytics is pretty interesting. So basically for videos, um, if you want to make money, it literally depends nothing on your views because it's all about how much people watch and how many like 
ads they watch because obviously more ads is more money so if your video is more than 10 minutes then you're allowed to like place ads wherever you want them they're called mid-roll ads and basically they'll like show up while the person is watching they watch through it then you get money but if they don't watch the ad and they skip it then you don't get any money which is why I always tell you guys not to skip the ad if you want to support your favorite youtubers then I would turn off like ad block and just watch their ads and something I wanted to show you guys was the CPM of the videos and basically CPM stands for cost per milli milli being a thousand and then you can like break it down for each video so I just sorted for all time my highest CPM so my number one video right now is my friend's own boyfriend dresses me for a week to school which is the one with Ethan and I just released that one like last week so I'm kind of surprised that the CPM is so high right now it's like my highest Correction, so the reason why the CPM is so high is because I just posted it so it hasn't racked up like a ton of views yet. So for each view, it, it's like more money because it's not like as popular and the people who are watching it are watching it for longer because they're like the more like dedicated people. So for the video with Ethan, it has $10.39 for the CPM and for my 1 million video, the CPM on there is... 4.95 which is about half of my highest so it's pretty low but not like the lowest it could be so the main reason why i think is because as people more people are watching your video obviously the number of people who don't care about you increases as well so they'll just skip your ads not watch through it and then they'll probably like skip through your video because they don't actually care what you have to say like as much and they just want to like get to the results or something which i am like not shading anyone for doing that because i do that too i'm just saying like that's just facts you know like no shade no tea just facts like i love that saying because it's very true. So basically the video with Ethan with the high CPM is at $10.39. YouTube actually takes half of that, so I'm making like $5.20, and that's per thousand views, right? So if I have 6,000 views, then I'll divide it by a thousand, so that's six. You take the six and you times it by half of your CPM, because YouTube took the other half, obviously. So it's around six times $5.20, which is, $31.20, so that's how much money I made on that video. But of course, it like changes a lot. Sometimes your CPM will literally be a dollar, so you technically only make 50 cents. So it really depends a lot. And actually sometimes my videos with less views have made more money than my videos with more views just because the watch time was longer, I guess, and there were more views, so the CPM was higher. So the video where I made the most money was actually, I asked my crush to prom, and here's what happened. I think because this title is very catchy, like, no one ever does this type of stuff, like, I've never really seen a girl asking guy to prom that much, and people were more interested in seeing, like, everything that happened, because it's like a vlog and not just, like, a results video where you would just, like, skip through, you know? So this video actually made a thousand 890 and 33 cents and the other one was a thousand five eighty eight so that's about three hundred dollars more and this one it only has six hundred thirty seven K Wow that's a lot less views oh my goodness four hundred thousand less views but for the prom video it has the CPM is 658 and then for my workout video it's only 495 so you can see that even though like it's like a dollar-ish difference it makes a really really big difference because each thousand views adds up to a lot more money so if you look at the average view duration as well for the prom video I got four minutes and ten seconds of view time and then the workout one only had three minutes and ten seconds so obviously people watched the prom one more so actually a less viewed video made me more money so if we look at my CPM based on geography, like the different countries, um, they actually vary. Most of my views came from the US and the CPM was 697. But what dragged down the overall CPM to be 495 is because there were viewers from the UK, Germany, Canada. Thank you guys so much for making it to the end of my video. I hope you guys learn something new and i'll be linking shelby church's video down below if you want to see it because she explains things a lot better than i do i think because i'm just all over the place i kind of lack organization and her videos are so like professional and nice to look at but i hope you guys enjoyed this nonetheless 
and I thought it'd be cool to see as many perspectives of different people because um, a lot of people make different amounts based on like how much people are watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you want. Don't skip the ads if you're watching more videos from my channel. Um, make sure to give it a like. And okay, that's enough rambling. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at kkatelee if you want to see my face even more. So yeah, bye guys. Um, I'll see you guys in my next video.